So first time at Doncaster Toy Fair. And I think there's another room upstairs where there is some stuff. So let's... Oh, straight away I've seen that. That's called Loch Ness. Called that? Loch Ness. What is it? <laughs> From the Highland Railway, that's very nice. Never run as new Lima 37. Oh, and nice. we've also got one of these. A Backman one. That's three things we could have bought already. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll just, we'll just go home now. <laughs> On another Kit Kat wagon. Ah. Well, they do come in twos, don't they? Oh. oh. <laughs> nice evening. Not bad for a five a day box, does it? Yeah, I think that's what we paid for ours. Yeah, yeah. Hmm, quite a nice selection here. Yeah, there is. I'm just mm. looking at this little set, nice. Everything's there. Oh, Lima, 25 quid. What is it? It's some foreign loco, isn't it? HO oh, is scale, it? yeah. Woolworth. <laughs> I've no idea. Somebody will tell us. You sell Woolworth. Okay. What's that green one there? That's the evening star. Yeah, it'll tend to drive one. Right. There's a fair amount of COVID cheers. Oh, and he takes a card. <laughs> oh, that's not good. Yeah. <laughs> Gosh, there's an awful lot of coaches. And they're good prices as well, because we need a few coaches, don't we? Look at all these wagons as well. Oh, right, yeah. So much are they? 450 each or three for 12. We've got the Cambrys one. Not bad at all. Yeah. That's in good condition, that one. And quite often we see the faded, don't we? Yeah. On Kit Kat. Lions made for the ice cream, the mighty white one. There's a lot of novelty wagons here. Mm. Benson's for beds. These are very good condition, these. Yeah, they might not be boxed, but they are really good condition. You know, every one of them. Yeah. They're absolutely immaculate, aren't they? It's quite nice to see, actually, isn't it? It is, yeah. Somebody's had these have really looked after them. Mm. So should we get a couple? Uh, I think we should now. Well, you're going to have to get that one, aren't you, really? Yeah, because we never see them in good condition. It is 50 year old near enough. They didn't make them for a long time, after the oh, early, right. up to the mid-70s. So that's one. I think we'll have the... That one, it's okay. a novelty wagon. So the next one, so there's nothing under there. I think we've got most of those. What about the lion's made? Well, I was thinking the same. Yeah. It's absolutely immaculate. Look, even the wheels. This has got metal ones though. They're all Hornby. But yeah, that's good. So let's keep looking on here, shall we? <laughs> there's another mighty white one. Okay. Mick, that seems quite small. Is yeah, that it's, a... um, it's an old triangle one. Oh, is it? Clarice do call it, yeah. It's not undersized, that's the it's a small coach. Oh, right, okay. I feel like that. I'm not keen. Oh, are you not? No. <laughs> we can't agree on everything, dear. No. So we've got some main light ones. So this stuff is all continental hay joe. I was going to say, because look at the colour on that. Low and brown. Pounds. Some beer, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, so is these it? are all hay joe. I look love these. these ones. Look at that. If I was into hay joe, I'd have that. <laughs> <laughs> what are these? Quite nice. Look so detailed though, don't they? You know, the underneath and so on. Yeah. Oh, you can even get them running though. Oh, always good to see him running. He's got lights and everything. Oh, nice. The Lima HO. Cheap the HO stuff, you know the old Lima? Yeah. And they tend to be better detailed, the old Lima HO ones, than the actual double O at the time. Right. Because they weren't as much of um, a budget brand. 
Right. So they weren't better quality. I mean, look, a pair of those, eight quid. That's good going, though. It's not though, a lemur, it? but it is. It's a good price. What make are they? I'm not sure. Oh, Kilt. Oh, I can't pronounce it. There we go. They're nicer. Yeah. They're nothing amazing, but they're up at the price. They're yeah. very good. It's that tank engine there. That one. The Mosley Tarmac. Oh, yeah. Fifty-five pounds. Are these are. So oh. it's, it's, oh, not true, sorry. Oh, nice. Yep. <laughs> like a narrow gauge, aren't they? Chester. Are they? Oh, yeah. Maybe not. Yeah. Yeah. Fleischmann oh. coaches. Thank you. Seven quid. It's good, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. One four. Not bad at all, that, is it? It's a track cleaning wagon. Oh, right. Jewel. Oh. And go with our new HL Loco, wouldn't it? <laughs> so, what are you thinking? I'm thinking it's sort of a. I think we'll get that as well. I think for £4 it's not bad, is it? Yeah. It's like these we were just looking at before. Yeah, but this is useful as well. Yeah. Rick? Yes. I don't want to point it out, but. Go on, I'm sorry. Oh. Oh. Look at all those rings. Yeah. We've got the rare ones as well. They're a lot of money. Oh. Are they? Yeah. <laughs> like the streamlined one. They only yeah. started doing that at the end of the 80s. So it's That's a very nice. That's um, nice, that. Yeah. Yeah. Are you going to ask how much? Oh, it'll be about 500. Oh, right, OK. <laughs> I'm not joking. And the green one, that's no experimental green on the castle class. So that was, um, that's quite rare. Are you going to well. ask? No. Nah. No? Nah. Not just for everybody else? Go on then. Can you just tell us what the prices are on these Renmonts here? Right. <laughs> <laughs> He's already unorganised. Yeah. Right. Seven, nine, Seven. Oh, right, yeah. No, no, it is what it is. I'm just asking. The blue one sort of the same price. Did it? Mm. Yeah. Right. It's in really good condition as well. Do you want to look? Yeah. 1.30. That's a non runner. Ah, oh, right. Ah, oh, right. Yeah, yeah. 65. Okay. Right. Thank Cheers. you for that. Right, look. Look at all these Del Six. That one's a 37. Oh, yeah. I didn't look at it, I just thought they were oh. all Del Six. Oh, there's another one there. I thought there's a, there's a High Mac as well. Oh, another 37. Yeah, yeah High Mac at the top there, yeah. yeah. The rest are all the same Del Six. So you buy a whole fleet and rename them. <laughs> That's the first thing we ever bought, that Alima Deltic, and it was it was in Doncaster at the Isn't exhibition about six years ago. And of all the Alima I've got, it's the best runner. It was the cheapest. Yeah, yeah. It was only 15 quid, because it's a bit, you know, a bit battered, but it runs better than all the others. Oh, there we go. I don't know if that's the, the Renault, the Dublo one. They're exactly the same. It's like that bright green one we've got. Yeah. You just give away the light on the Oh, right. Causing a shadow out, uh, over my filming. <laughs> it's a Lima Class 20. Very heavy, that. You've only got your Royal Train. Oh. Very nice. I'm soft with camel. <laughs> Much worse, much, much. We couldn't make it a fellow raccoon. That's metal, that. Is that? Yeah. This is good to say. And I can't read what it, I think it says Fleischmann on it. It weighs an absolute ton. <laughs> Not what you expect sometimes, is it, when you pick no, them up? No, when it's that small as well, yeah. Right. What you seen? 
with too much stuff really, I'm afraid. Yes. <laughs> you can buy, get another stall, but it comes to the point of uh, diminishing returns. So. Yeah. This is one I've not seen before. Primex. £40 HO tank engine. Looks to be German or something. It's a new one. Yeah, it's a be a three rail one. Oh, is it three rail? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, there we go. There's something new. There's a skate underneath. There's a skate underneath. Yes, I can see it now, yeah. There's two Markley ones over here, what's called Markley and Hamer, which are two rail DC. Yeah. Those are three rail AC. They're all running on me double track. Good times of that. <laughs> it's that small account, see what it is. I don't know. It doesn't tell you. It doesn't tell me. Ren, engage? No. <laughs> Wren didn't make Engage. What they did do is sell Lima stuff as Wren Engage. Really? In the early 70s, yeah. <laughs> well, the 60s, the 70s, late, late 60s, early 70s. You know, before they were doing their own stuff, really. Yeah. So made in Italy by Lima for GNR Wren Limited, as of the Nessex. <laughs> nice bit of, you know, history there. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, they stopped doing it by the early 70s, I think. But yeah. Yeah, it's funny that. Not it what is. Expect. No. It would be nice to get one just as a bit of memorabilia almost at some point. Yeah. Oh, look at these. Hmm? Remember those in the 70s? Everybody had them, everybody smashed yeah. them up. Now they're going for 100 quid. I mean, those are mint, aren't they? Yeah. But as is everything else here. Hello. <laughs> And professionals. <laughs> Something I'd like. Odie and Dale. Yep. Oh, come on. Big reveal. £8.50. Triangle. Oh, it's a Triangle Continental, well, American style, isn't it really? Diesel. Ah, right, okay. I wouldn't have had a clue. No, quirky. <laughs> These are all tin plate Hornby Dublin. I was just thinking that I thought so. Plastic wheels so we can go on modern track. Oh, look over here, Pauline. Some Ren hoppers, three of them there. Oh, they're quite 50. nice, aren't they? Yeah. Four pound. Good condition, that one. Yeah. The new wheels on as well. Correct, it's a bargain, it is a bargain coach, coach yeah. yeah. As is this. No, I do like that. Not because it's blue, but you know. Well, blue and gold is everything yeah. for you there, isn't it? But hey. This track cleaning car. <laughs> Quite like that. And you fill it up there. <laughs> good, that. Yeah. It does look good, actually, doesn't it? Mm. Newish as well though, it's not old. Look, the couplings. Yeah. It's very technical, doesn't it? Yeah. Nice, that. What have we got here? Bargain. It's £5.50, that's good going, isn't Two, it? Two, yeah. It's an old triangle one. That's a kit by the look of it. This one's added the curtains in it, I think. Oh, it's triangle, so it's not a kit, my mistake. Just old. I've been messed with a bit. What's this one? Again, Triang. Yeah. How's is this? <laughs> I think most of them are in here. Hence I recognise some of them like those, that yeah. styling. Very nice. So nice, aren't they? Two those? of them there, yeah. See why I love the Pullmans. Have a look in this wagon box. Yeah, sure. $3.50, Hornby. I've not seen that one. No, I haven't. I don't think I have, anyway. Mm. A lot of brake bands. 
two pound. It's all intact, just no box. What's that? It's a quid. Put anything on that then, couldn't you really? Yeah, I mean, you can do whatever you want with that at that price. Has it been repainted? Oh, have they? Yeah. I don't recognise them. But no. Yeah. Two quid. What's hiding under here? And what's the stall name again? Um, Anorax Anonymous. It's four. It's a lot new with that. Look at all the sacks. Yeah, they've all got, um, look like proper so, house roofs on them. <laughs> yeah, the salt wagons do. It's a red one. They? Yeah, a red one, that. Nice. I like them. They've got quite a different variant on colour there. Yeah. What's this? It's Ren as well. They are there in here. What are so ones then? Oh, wow, there is, isn't there? Look at all these. <laughs> Hornby. Seven. Well, look at these ones. It's an old triangle one. That's very old, that. Is it? Yeah. Looks quite small, doesn't it? It, it is indeed. Custard. Four pound. Lima. I've seen that one before. You okay, sir? I sent a few coaches we need. <laughs> Bernard Wallet. We saw this stall at Elsica because there's that um, poor son, like there's that 30 pound Pullman. Oh, Vera, yes. that's the one, yeah. And we did need one of these, don't we? A couple more of them to add to it. There's the box one there. Well, they're that common. We'll just hang on for a bit. You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, there's a go. This is um, the ambulance car from the battle space stuff. You know, the tanks yeah. and all that. That goes with that. 12 quid. Not bad, is it? Five pounds each on this lot. Yeah, they're the very, very old ones. Yeah, they were a different blue at first. Oh, right. Well, oh, they've been electric blue before they got the colours right. I think we've got all those. <laughs> Dear. Yeah. So we've got that one, but it's, it's in mainline packaging. Oh well. Is there anything we haven't got? We'll stand there. What have you seen? Um, nothing in particular, I was just browsing. It's not anything from 70 to 95 yeah, it's on quite this a bit. Line, though. Look at that though. What's that? Oh, the mallard, yeah. <laughs> hmm. Oh, we got a person. <laughs> we do want a person. We will get a person, I'm sure of it. At some point. Definitely, yeah. How cute are those? I just say, Paul, look at all those Kit Kat wagons. I know, I noticed in all the fish ones and Kellogg's and there's another Heinz one. Beaties were like the main model shop, you know, in the 80s and the 90s till they went bust. Oh, really? We've got my old stuff from there, yeah. Back in the day, eh, dear? Yeah, I'm not that old, leave it <laughs> out. I used a child. Yeah. So I was going to say, this is Muffy's models. Ah, oh, right, okay. There we go. Muff his models. Anybody needs to get hold of them? So you search for. Oh, and they take card. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen this one here? Yeah, yeah. Nice red one. 
pie crust. Right? Yeah. Twelve pounds. I like the colour. We've got a yellow yeah. one. That is nice. Two cranes there. Chevrolet. Should look at the cars at the end. Look at what? What's that? Sorry. Oh, that one. It's um, just a Hornby tank engine, gin. Still want a Percy though. <laughs> you really want one of those, don't you? If you look at him, it's by far Hornby. My favourite Thomas character is Percy. That's why he named a cat after him. <laughs> That's cute, isn't it? Isn't it? I've not seen a Pullman in the top link packaging before either. Oh, right, okay. Seen these. £15. That's well, the two of them, isn't it? yeah. That's good, that. 15 and 16. Let's say we've got a pink. Is it the Mr. Smith bubble car? £5. That's a good price, that. It isn't is, it? isn't it? They're usually six or seven. I can't see where it says what it is. It's like a peach colour, isn't it? Yeah, peach, that's it. Are there all the five of these, Pauline? Oh. Oh, what have you seen? Oh, caravan. <laughs> How did it say? <laughs> Go on. There's a blue caravan. Oh. I'm hooked. We've not got a caravan, have we? No. I don't think you tend to find one in the car park at a railway station, though. You do? You have people living in it. <laughs> Forgot to mention, we put um, a competition up on the YouTube page, guessing what loco we'd bought, or you had got. Ah. And Mark won. Right. Straight away, so well done, Mark. No, well done. He knows me well. <laughs> he did. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Who is Do you it? remember that program? No, what is it? It was a, you not know, remember there used to be mum and dad and I'm fifty two, I'm not gonna remember that, am I? You are. You've <laughs> got to remember that. What was that program called? Dinosaurs. There you go. Nineteen ninety two. I remember that. I know yeah. who he is. <laughs> <laughs> Again, not showing enough engage. What is that? Phillips. Interesting. Mm. Oh, look at this. Little terrier. In Engage. <laughs> and I was saying before about the, the Lima stuff made for Wren. Yeah, just wasn't I mean, like These are so thinking. old. Packaging's in amazing condition. Yeah. I've got some of those one day. Oh, just as like a little thing. <laughs> You know what I mean, just to put there, not to use. There'll be no point. We got one of these the other day, didn't we? <laughs> it's a different number to ours, though. Was it? Yeah. <coughs> that's the R1 tank. I think that's the old one. I think that might be Hormy Doubler rather than Red. It's exactly the same. Nice. Lima set, Deltic, three coaches. £75. Nice. In very good condition. Yeah. There's a few of them here. Look, what's underneath? Oh, yeah. It's all coaches, that one. The talisman. I often see them. We see them now and again. It's like usually here we see them. Yeah. I do like those. We've ridden behind one of those at the East Langs Railway. Ah, City yeah. of Wales. That lovely livery, that first Great Western. That looks absolutely stunning, doesn't it? Can we get a closer oh. look? Get my that fingers out of the way. Yeah, that is really nice, isn't it? Yeah. I like that. There's not many modern liveries I do like, but that is one. So I like the really colourful ones. I just love that, the green and gold. Mm. I can see why. Okay. See why. I mean, that's green as well, but that's a different green. Yeah, I don't like that. Okay. Warrington. £40. I think we've got that. Oh, really? Yeah. Was it Dinting? 
Warrington. Ah. Been renamed and repainted. It's at another li railway near us now. But, um, look at these. £67. I think we need to get one of those one day. I mean, that is as little and cute as you can get, <laughs> isn't it? Really? How tiny is it? In it's compared... about that big. Oh. That's a normal size wagon behind it. Oh. Yeah. Right, I see. See what it is, because it's so short, it has problems picking up the electric over points. It picks it up from the wagon as well, uh, so it doesn't stall. Uh, but yeah, they good do, idea. You, they do what like would you a, put on it? Sweets, I don't know. <laughs> is that someone to feed you yeah. it by a bit? Oh, look. Mmm, <laughs> bacon <laughs> juice sink. Wow, look at it here, Charlie's Angels. Where I was a fan of the Charlie's Angels. Yes, yes, really. Mmm. And there's the moon buggy from Diamonds Are Forever next to it. Miss Piggy. Hi. Come, Kermy. <laughs> oh, gold. I know you hate those. I thought they'd all been taken away and burned. <laughs> Melt it down, make lady toys out of. Look at the size of that. Oh, wow. G scale. G scale, wow. Hundred pounds. It's a Metro. Uh, yeah, I've had two of those in my Royal years. Mail, Metro. <laughs> it's one I spent on the Not in a Royal Mail. It's a good condition, isn't it? Mm. Pauline. Two metros. <laughs> You're not tempted? No. Okay. Sweet mail. Yeah, just sign it lens tracks, aren't they? Yeah. I mean, you last forever the three rail track. Yeah, I can imagine. We will pick some up at some point. We're looking there. Mm. I got that one. Been re wheeled. It's not the original box. Oh. Won't be doubler. Later we came round because we have one with a different thing on. It's been rewheeled as well. We've got one of these of the older ones, a mainline one, on replica railways. This looks a lot more detailed. I do like them. Plus it's LMS, which is my favourite region of. The big four. Oh, is it? It is indeed, yeah. <laughs> All no, in the room. I have a favourite. <laughs> well, I do have a favourite. I started liking the southern as well because I love the green. Ah, but I so didn't. It's more to do with the colouring then, and the livery. That's, that's a, and the locos <laughs> they used. Ah, oh, right, okay. I mean, you'd like the LNER because of the mallard and the flying Scotsman. Oh, yeah. What's that red one there? It's a Duchess of Gloucester, the Streamline Pacific. You know those big Wren locos you've got? Well, that's the streamliner they had on them. Right, £79, yeah. What's that? That is another 33. So it's a Hornby Railroad 33, which will be the old Lima one. And it doesn't look like they've done a lot of, added any detail to it. We've got a different motor in. Right. And different wheels. But apart from that, it looks exactly the same. Yeah. Hence the keep the price down. It's more of a budget range. Right. I just say here, a lovely Backman Deltic. Nice. Which is four pounds. Tick nice, aren't they? It is. It'd make our deltas look very small. <laughs> yeah. Right. That's lovely, isn't it? Isn't it? North yes. British, it's called. It's the same as the Tornado loco, I think. Right. What have we got in here? I'm guessing it's an R1. Oh, it's a shunter. Ren Shunter. And look at the shadow, darling. Oh, yeah. It's quite nice, isn't it? It is. Beautiful very, little one. Very, very good condition box as well. Yeah. It's 59. Fork Kyle. I don't know where that is. Oh, we've got a lot of scenery oh, and gosh, stuff in here, haven't that we? That is really mega heavy. Look at the weight on that. It is, isn't it? 
can't see that on camera the way. No. <laughs> it's all like that. Yeah. So, What's that? I don't know. Is it just a body or something? I have no idea. It's like <laughs> some locos. Oh, lots of bits and pieces. It's the old age show, is it? Are the old bits of triangle and all sorts here? I don't think they're a two pound anymore. Are they just bodies though? No, they're the... are they? I can't tell from here. Yeah, they are, yeah. That's weird. I thought they... <laughs> oh, look at this. Bodies in a box, you wouldn't expect. It's nice, Ooh, isn't it? It is nice. Proto nice. 2000. Mm. Oh, what are these? No pantographs. Again, unusual. More foreign stuff. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? H.O. Hey, again. They really have some nice things on H.O. Hey, because it's all foreign and unusual and exotic yeah. to us, that's why. Yeah. I think everything's H.O. Hey, in here. Two quid. Can't go wrong at these prices. 37 quid. Yeah. 39. Oh, what's in that round there? Oh, you can't help yourself, can you? I think it's only a small one. Do you reckon? I reckon it's a 264 tank engine. <laughs> Sorry, I'm struggling to... No, Come I'm not on. lifting it off. Won't lift off. i try again. There we go. Have a guess. <laughs> no idea. It's the 264 tank engine. The standard for... What made you guess that one? Size of the box. Ah. There's two more there to guess. Oh, great. Oh, it says on those ones. A Cardiff Castle and an ATF on them. Uh -oh. Yeah, a bit new for us. Yeah, like it. Just though. a bit. Yeah, so they're the ATF and the castle. They're quite nice. 22. 24. Very good prices actually. Aren't they? It's a shame the um, dodgy run is the main line. <laughs> How are they? Oh. And it's such, you might like say it is a shame. Oh, I like that. It's a nice 33 that one, isn't it? I do like that colour. White and silver. Very nice. Lima. 26 quid. 15. I used to have that one. Yeah. Those are 33s. Oh, there's a box Percy there. What do you reckon how much it is? 40 quid. Let's have a look. 27. He's seen better days, hasn't he? Might yeah. just need a bit of a clean, actually. We will find one one day. <laughs> Don't you worry. Two locos for 25 quid. What's in here? That Duchess of Apple, the old Hornby Dublin. It's very old. It's the ATF. Later became a Ren one. Oh, it is Ren actually. So it is Ren. Oh, right, okay. Oh, sorry, I didn't see the yeah. sticker. You can't tell the difference anyway, they're identical. Let's have a look over here. Steamers. Black 5. Back him on that one. There's some round there. See the really old Hornby packaging though. Nice. I like that one. Yeah, we've, we've got that. Oh, right, that's yeah. okay then. <laughs> it's a bit clunky. Let's look at this one. This is the city of Wells. an awful lot of cash.
can we see it a little bit more in detail? More detail on than the old ones. Sorry, that's... <laughs> It's absolutely immaculate, as you'd expect. It's even got cab detail in. Oh. But it's a lot newer. Right. It, there when was only three locos that Ren made that weren't old Hornby Dublo ones. They were actually tooled up for themselves and got them made. Right. Oh, what's that? I'll get distracted by the books. <laughs> oh, what have you seen? OK. How's it? What, uh... It's in foreign, so... Ah, oh, right, OK. I was hoping for an ice cream shop. I'm sure there's there. more than one foreign language, but I can't even make it out. I think it's French. I do like looking at the buildings though. Yeah. Because it's not something you ever remember. There's so many different types. Arkwrights. Arkwrights. <laughs> hardware supplies. With people outside. Yeah. There's just bits of all sorts, and if you know what you're doing to either fix them up to make them look a little bit better. Well, you can just take or... bits off and use them for yeah. something else, can't you? I mean, if you know what you're doing, you sort of... It's great, isn't it? There's a booking hall. And postcards. If you've got one like, two, two, two of art, that's Let's have a look. You never know what's going to be there. They're yeah, quite good, though, aren't they? Yeah. That looks familiar. <laughs> Spam can. I like them. It's just something different, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah. I've not seen these before. No, I haven't. It's not something we tend no. to look at, is it? No. We're too busy looking at other things and sometimes it's nice to see what's on the stores, other things on the stores, but they're lovely, aren't they? These are cheap. Found. Sorry, quid. Oh, we're having that. <laughs> okay. Any change. Obviously, they... I've got that one. What's this? It's the bitter one by the look of it. Oh, right, I see. <laughs> oh. So what are these? Oh, they're kits. You better save that for a, another day. So, what have we bought today? <laughs> the cutie caravan. Fiver. Yep. Um, what was that again? That's um, this... Peter Sellers Mini. Ah. Also a fiver. Not bad going. Not bad going. For some reason. <laughs> a Oh. HO track cleaning tanker. Four quid, so can't complain. No? To and... go with the HO you've already bought? Yeah, we actually successfully found some novelty <laughs> wagons and that's the Cadbury's one we got um, three of them unboxed for £12 best thing being about them is they're absolutely really really good condition yeah so we're, somebody's really looked after that's these Benson's for beds that one isn't it I'm not sure I'll be honest it's not of them rolling off yeah okay <laughs> and then Lion's made ice cream yeah that's like all we've say, bought they're just in really good condition <laughs> our little Lego man of oh, Rick, my choosing. No comment. How much did you pay for that? <laughs> pound. It cost pound. me a pound. Put it together, yes. Okay. That was funny. Oh. It's like a sort of Frankenstein's monster of me, oh, isn't it? It's going. <laughs> he looks way too happy. <laughs> he does, doesn't he? <laughs> I thought it was funny though. 
we were limited to what we could find but no i thought that was funny so we shall see you again next time thanks for watching bye